Circumstances often arise which require you to take a picture of what's on your screen to send to somebody. For instance, if you're developing a website and you want to show a web page to somebody and make sure that they're seeing exactly what you're seeing, you'll want to take a snapshot of your screen. The Mac OS offers you a few ways to do it. Each different way has its own keyboard shortcut. The first one takes a picture of the whole screen. So you'll use Shift, Apple, and 3. And that gives you a picture of the whole screen like this. So here's my browser. I'll hit Shift, Apple, 3. And then I get this. So you're seeing it, we're seeing it in preview. And this is a picture including the Safari menu up here. So it took the whole screen. The second way of doing it is to use Shift Apple and 4. So in that case, I'm going to close this, you can take a picture of a specific area. So I'm going to switch to Photoshop and I have some palettes here. I want you to see the layers palette. So in this case, I can do Shift Apple 4 and you can see that my cursor turns into a crosshair and then I can go ahead and drag an area and then this is what I get. This is the picture I just took. There's an even better way of getting a picture of a specific area on the screen, especially if it's a window or an icon. You do Shift Apple 4, it's exactly the same as the previous one, but you hit the space bar and look at this, you get a camera. So whatever you hover over, it'll take a picture of. So here I'll click over my tool palette and it just took a picture of it and there it is. I get a PNG file of my tool palette. So you have Shift Apple 3, Shift Apple 4, and Shift Apple 4 with the space bar. That's four, three different ways of taking a screenshot in OS X.